Well, hello everyone, and welcome back here to the RimWorld. You join us almost immediately after we last spoke, and things are moving on a pace. We are just about, we're not quite, we've got one more block to do. We've just about got the uh, the kitchen area, the communal area sorted out. There it goes. Okay, so we will now have a, uh, a, a walled off uh, living area. It's in the dark at the moment, so that's something we're going to have to deal with as a priority. Let's get some power conduit put through to there, say, and we'll put a standing lamp there. And we put it, yeah, we can, can we put it there? Yeah, we can put it there. Let's put it there. That'll illuminate the room from the middle. And maybe people are sitting around the table and chatting, which is a, a bit of joy, which is going to make people happier. It's all looking good. Right, low food. Uh, it's not surprising. Uh, why is that not... Why is that not powered? Reconnect. There we go. It's now powered. Excellent. All right. Uh, we actually need to start storing some of this power, to be totally honest here. But until... Then let's get some bills in. Add bill. Actually, first things first. First things first, let's get ourselves a, a quick zone. We'll just drop it in the middle of this room. Uh, zones, stockpile zone. Just like that. And storage. This one's important. Let's clear everything out of that. And we want foods, we want meals. And the only thing we want here is meals. That's all we have there. Now just drop those in the middle there. And then anyone wants a meal can just come in here and grab one. That'll make them happier. All right, there you go, they're all getting stacked up nicely. All right, and then we can add bills in here. So we'll add a bill. Cook simple meal. Do until you have X. And we don't want 10. Let's, let's do it till we have eight. Details. And we'll just shrink the uh, the, zone, the area that they'll go to to pick up stuff like that. Okay, there we go. Right. We don't have any food for them to cook meals out of, so we need to deal with that. And I think well, that's what we're going to deal with this episode. But first of all, add Bill, Butcher Creature, Do Forever, uh, Details, Take the Best Stockpile, is good. Okay, uh, oh, sorry, Details... There we go. All right. Okay, and now we've done that. Now we can start thinking about doing some hunting. And looks like it's going to be camel for dinner tonight. Uh, hunt. Camel. Anything else that's hunt worthy? Uh, warning, Merica Scarabs will usually attack when harmed. That's what we'll just do. We'll I'll leave those highlighted for now. Uh, there's another camel there. We'll grab them. And... Yeah, well, in the middle of the desert, there's not much to hunt. That's not really that surprising. However, that's 70% grown, so that will be happening soon. Uh, it's going to take a while. Let's just watch Seraph. Yeah. Not much of a shot, are you, mate? Not much of a shot. Finished researching hydroponics. Excellent. Right. Um. Oh. I can't believe we've gone so long without being attacked. So let's start thinking about that. Let's get some mortars researched. There we go. All right. A mega scarab is attacking after being harmed. Let's see what happens here. Well done. Let's have a look at you. Health. A bite to the torso. Bleeding a little bit. Is that the other? Okay, right. Well, we know not uh, that uh, hunting mega scarabs is a bad idea. Oh, look at this. Um, we need to haul some stuff by looks of it. So, 
We have so many people idle. Let's get all these stone hauled onto the uh, the pile there, and we can make um, bricks out of it. Next thing we need to make here is a refrigerated area, but uh, what we need at this point is we need a medical bed. So we'll set that one as medical, and then our our guy can go there. Ooh. An iguana. Hmm. Oh, nice. Right. Who is our doctor? Uh, Lucky. Uh, yep, he's treating Sarah. Excellent. Right. The eclipse is ended. Be nice if you use solar panels. I'd be very happy at this point. So what should we make next? I think what we need to make next is a battery. Uh, is a yeah. I think what we need to make next is some energy storage, and we'll do it right here. I think. So structure limestone walls. So two space for door, two wall like that, and oh dear, psychic, psychic drone. We'll deal with that in just a second. Uh, let's get this sorted out first. So we'll just mine out that block like that, and we'll put a door on this. And how are we doing for wood? Let's make it. Let's make it slate door. There we go. So we'll put a slate door on the front of it. And we'll, when that's built, we'll put some batteries in there. And what's the obvious thing we want to do here is line this up to the power conduit. And then we'll just put batteries down either side, and that should do the job. Okay. Uh, right. Let's have a look at some of this. Summer has begun, but winter is coming. Your food crops won't grow in the winter cold. Be sure you store several months' worth of food now while you still can. You can build a walk-in refrigeration room to prevent food from spoiling, and try to buy steel or make some parkas, or you'll freeze when you step outside. Oh, great. Any colonist of male gender winces in pain. Some distant engine of hatred is stirring. It's projecting a powerful psychic drone over the entire region on a frequency that only seems to affect the male gender. For a few days, some people's moods will be quite a bit worse. Useful. So very useful. Okay, um, once that's built and we start storing from power, we'll start thinking about making ourselves a Mega Scarab Revenge. Poor Seraph. Oh, he, he got away with it all right this time. Okay, good work. You see how easy it is if you actually hit what you're shooting at? There we go. That's building up quite nicely. And... I think we can actually put some three, four, five. Uh, it's probably going to use up a lot of our existing metal. So let's start looking around for. There we go. There's loads of metal there. So let's get that. Let's mine. So we just mine that area out. That'll give us some more metal. There's more around. There's well, there's loads around here, isn't there? Oh, it's plasteel. Very nice. And that's steel. We'll need that in towards the end game, but we don't need it just yet. Actually, there's a lot of metal in this rock, so this is good. Right. I think we're doing quite well. Ah, a group of pirates from the Godlessness Party have arrived in drop pods nearby. They are attacking immediately. Where are they? Well, not much of a group. Ben, a cook. Ah, quick for the marble shiv. He's attacking one of our wind turbines. Okay, so. Which one of our guys? I think it's Holiday. Holiday is... Yeah, he's our pacifist, but the rest of the guys. Draft you. Where's he likely to come? Who's that? It's a dromedary. Okay. Looks like a person from this distance. Um, where should we get you guys? Alright, let's, oh, let's put wall here for now. Okay, so Seraph. I want you to go there. Davis, you go there, and Lucky, you go there for now. Actually, that's not good. 
probably going to come down here, isn't he? So actually, this is a better, this is a better place. Like that, like that, and Seraph, you go there. There we go. Speed this up a little bit. Hello, Ben. Boy, do we have a greeting for you. Ow, and we have a building to put a... a yep, that'll do. Right. Undraft you guys. We're going to unban that. An awful shiv. It's not really that great a thing, but it will do the trick. And if we just put in... A sleeping spot here. And... Will we stone? No, right. Oh, we have loads of stone. Okay. Um, Davis. Uh, I thought I undrafted you. Okay. Prioritize working on slate door. We have any slate? We have loads of slate. Lucky. Thought I undrafted you as well. Prioritize working on limestone wall and seraph. You just go around doing what you're doing. And once that's built, we'll make that a prisoner bed. Lucky, sorry mate, you need to do need to get that done. Likewise, Davis. Need to get that done tonight. I know it's your sleeping time, but I need you guys to do things for me. So Lucky you're done. I think I can set that as prisoner now. No, can't set outdoor prisoner. Can't get this done. You're not a good builder, are you? Probably getting very tired at this point as well. Right, okay. That is a prisoner bed. Davis. I want you to go and capture Ben. And Ben, let's have a quick look at you. Uh, you're a hard worker, but you're psychically sensitive. You're incapable of a lot of stuff. Uh, so you're a good cook. No, you're not even a good cook. I think I might hand you back, to be totally honest with you. Uh, though on the other hand, you can probably haul. Davis. You go and sleep, that'll make you feel better. Yeah, sorry to keep you up all night. Lucky when you wake up, we're probably going to get you to... Let's have a quick look at Ben here. Needs... Prisoner. Uh, doctor's care gets food. I don't like it. Let's get rid of it. Hold on a sec. But do I actually want to stop the pirates from attacking me at this point? The answer to that is no, I don't. So I think we're going to take you anyway. We're going to try to recruit you anyway. Um, might end up regretting that, but we'll see. So... It's your health. Okay, the rest of your stuff has been sutured up. Oh, gunshot and a kidney. That's not going to... Davis. I think we're going to have a problem with you, Davis, aren't we? There are you. Is it because you're in the dark mining? Needs. Open environment. Disturbed sleep. Tired. And the psychic drone. I think... Let's just keep you chugging along for a little bit. Hopefully you'll survive the psychic drone. We'll see. At... Um, what I do want to do here is let's get that hold and there we go and let's get a lamp in here there we go right that do us we still have one own bed we've Okay, so Davis is there, still slight, uh, lagging on it. Right, that'll harvest today. 
So I think we'll be alright for food. Ben has developed an infection in his left leg. Um, who's there? Get medicine. There we go. That's, might as well use it on him. Okay. Right. He's in the light. Lucky's there. He's treating his infection. All is going well, I think. All is going well. Poor mood. Ah, that's better. That's much better than the terrible mood, isn't it? Okay, so we are chugging along nicely. We are getting some battery power being stored here. That is good. I think it is time for us to start thinking about uh, making a refrigerated area, isn't it? So let's look at that next. So mortars has been researched. And I think the next one we're going to do is... Um, don't need any of the, 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 the smarter stuff just yet. Um, let's do shipbuilding basics. It's done quickly and it opens up a few bits from later on. And it's nothing else in the list I particularly want at the moment. So, let's build ourselves a little structure here. Uh, limestone wall. One, two. I think that's big enough. And... Uh, we don't actually, because it's... Hmm. Oh dear, should we do that? It does get cold in the winter, so what I'm thinking we'll do is we will actually do it this way. We'll build a, a, a refrigerated area there, but we'll do it by taking a cooler that's going to freeze there and freeze there. So surplus heat will come through into this room and surplus heat will come out of that one. We might actually need to put a second one of these um, coolers there, but that will that result in air conditioning this room and also air conditioning this room. Uh, the coolers will keep this room cold during the summer and the exhaust heat from this room will keep this room warm during the winter and everyone should be reasonably happy. Or slightly less grumpy in case, in case may be. So we'll, we'll do that. And actually, we might as well put the zone in as well. So we'll zone this here. And this zone, clear all priority. Let's make this one critical. This will be for raw food and animal corpses. There we go. Actually, I don't, I think when I set, yeah, look, when I set up the hunting, they didn't get these haul, corpses hauled, did I? Which is a bit bad. Davis. Hauling dramedy. Oh, you good man. You are a good man there. Excellent. Uh, there we go. Yeah, and because the hauling has started, we are actually starting to get some meat created, which means we're starting to get some meals cooked. I think that's pretty good. Okay. Probably going to end up having to kill that mega scarab because it's going to end up in there knowing our luck, but uh, that's not too bad, is it? Alright, so. Yeah. That's going. I was going down because oh, the wind doesn't blow at night. Okay, that's interesting to know. So that geothermal plant is suddenly become so much more important, is it? So let's build it now. Geothermal generator. Bang. When that's built, that one will become less useful, so we'll, we'll deconstruct that one. But look how hell the wind blows during the day. We really get the power coming up during the day, which is excellent. I think this is gonna, these are going to phase in at different times of the day, whereas the geothermal one is constant. And uh, That's fine by me. There we go. Look at this. Yep, we have meals being cooked. That will cheer them up. Medicine, that medicine dies down. In fact, what I need to do now is think about trading. So let's do that now. Production. Miscellaneous. Orbital trade beacon. We should drop there. And we are going to need a trading console. Comms console, there we go. Does this fit in here? Just... Let's put it there. And 
Let's have a wooden stool. Like that. Ancient danger. As Davis draws near the ancient wall, a sense of foreboding overcomes him. He isn't sure why, but he feels that this dusty structure may contain great danger. Ooh. It's probably going to be some cryptic sleep caskets in there, and knowing our luck, some very nasty people too. Ooh. Um, you, my friend, are for the pot. Is there any, actually, is there anything else we can designate as hunting, uh, huntable? I don't want to do the mega scarabs because they're not much food and they fight back. And it's not properly sporting if they fight back, is it? No, that seems to be there's one carol in the whole area, but we're getting the potatoes harvest now. So that'll do nicely. Okay, guys, I think that is the end of the episode, so I shall say uh, goodbye to you guys. Uh, until so until the next time please uh, if you'd like this leave a like if you haven't subscribed please do subscribe and if you ha have a comment to make even if it's just want to say hello please leave a comment below because it helps me very much with YouTube rankings but until the next time I've been Summer Parsons this has been the Rimworld thank you and good night